Now I'm going to take the hole out, or the stem, and we don't have a little stemmer thing. So I'm going to use this little knife. So I'm going to do... Yeah, so I got all but two and a half of them on one tray. So I have an empty yogurt container. And I just put a gallon Ziploc into it with the one corner down at the bottom. So I'm going to use it as a piping bag. And then take a quart of yogurt and I'm going to make sure it's stirred up well first. A smooth kind of yogurt would probably work best but this one has some fruit chunks in it so it could clog up the tip a bit. Okay, it's all stirred up. I'm going to transfer it to the the bag. <coughs> now, of course you could use an actual piping bag and piping tips and things. And now it's ready to close the bag up and get ready to pipe them out. Okay. It's just like a giant piping bag. I'm going to cut a small hole in it and pipe the piece. Oh, I want to make sure I don't lose that piece of plastic somewhere. Okay, so starting with a pretty small hole, and we'll see if that works.
Okay. Super little dry things. Wow, that's good. Okay, check a thick area on, make sure that there's no cold spots. And that's 100% dry. Oh, that looks great. These are great. Wow. Make these separate. Ah, they're just so light. Like mm. really dry yogurt. I wonder if it has a tail. I wonder if it has a mirror so it has a hot spot right there. So maybe I guess they never really make that so hard. Mm -hmm. 